Hi, hi, I'm here. I'm going to do a boil test on this Vargo titanium converter stove. I've got two fluid ounces of methanol in here, and I don't know if you'll be able to see in the camera, but it's about halfway up this dished area like I said it would be. Uh, got two cups of water going back and forth between 60 and 61 degrees. What I'm going to do is light this and put the pot right on. Oops, just went out. Put the pot right on and test it, see how long it takes this to get to a bloom and then how long it takes for it to come to a boil. So let's light this. Again, two cups of water. Setting at 60 degrees. Yep, right on 60. And let's see how long this takes to come to a bloom and then how long to boil. Here we have 210, 211, 212 at 929. Remember, sometimes got to be taken off that for waiting for the bloom. Let's see how long this runs before run out. Okay, we're going, oh, it's starting to sputter, going, let's say, still a little flame in the tube, let's say gone at 44, what's that, 14, 44, 14, wow. Really have to do something about being able to light this without having to fill it. So that was two cups of water starting at 60 degrees. Room temperature is uh, 45 degrees, humidity 42. It's snowing outside. It got, I lit it, it got to a bloom in about a minute 53 seconds. Water temperature had gotten up to 63 degrees or 83 degrees by that time came to a boil in 9 minutes 29 seconds which if you adjust it for the bloom I guess that doesn't really matter so that's the hard part about timing jetted stoves that have to come to a bloom give me the fancy feast you just put the pot on light it and let it go but I'll put all the information down below we're really gonna have to do something filling this up with the two fluid ounces of methanol unless you want to do something like baking or boiling a big pot of water having it run for 44 minutes I don't, know, I don't know how many times you'd have to do something like that so I'll have all the information down below in the text area this just <laughs> flabbergasts me so anyway I thank you for watching I look forward to your input questions remarks helpful suggestions and as always watch for my buddy Max bye now